Hello everyone, welcome back to Wide Ocean Big Jacket. Uh, we're playing with As Ben, not with Ben, we're playing As Ben. Uh, let's start a fire, I guess. Maybe if I add a couple of these. Okay, let's try again. Wow, that's a lot of smoke. Uh, you got this, Ben. Woohoo! I'm doing it! He did. He, he did make a fire. Good job. What are we cooking? Oh, man, you really got going this morning. Yeah. I'm having fun. It's like a tiny little life. Sure. Wait. What do you mean? Like, I'm living a full life, but just smaller. Like... My real life is out there and is big. But here is a different, smaller life. No? I don't follow. No. I'm sorry, I have a hard time without my coffee. Here, I'll pour you a cup. Good man. Yeah, I think I get what you're saying. Are well, you camping? campground becomes your whole world and the campsite is like your place in the world like your house or your town so it's all kind of squished what's that word condensed exactly interesting thought there's a lot of sugar in this coffee man sorry oh we're all waking up hey mort so that's sleeping in a tent. How'd it go? My bones hurt. My bones hurt too. Is that why you brought that skeleton? Extra set of bones for the morning? Okay, seriously, what's the skeleton about? Low bones? He helps us find our camps out at night. Can be easy to get turned around. Brad and I got him the second time we ever went camping. Way before we were married. You bring him every time now. Aw, I don't want a glow bones. Ben thought you were low-key serial murderers or something. No, but I... Ha <laughs> ha! I didn't think you were going to murder us. Ha <laughs> Funny. Very funny. Hey, Ben. Morning. How do you sleep? Like a big pile of bricks. You snore like a pile of bricks. <laughs> How do you sleep? Benjamin. I slept really well, actually, and it was fun to, well, sleep near you. Yeah. Hey, do me a favor. What? Call me honey, would you? Just try it. Honey. Oh, come on. Use it in a sentence. Like this, honey? Hmm. That'll do. I like it. Everybody's awake now. Good morning, Mort. Ben, get a load of this guy. What about him? Yeah, what about... Classic example of hungover person. You know, oh yes, I can see it. The sunken, bloodshot eyes. The hot, putrid breath. Slowed reflexes and reduced neural activity. Even now he's struggling to remain cognizant. Whatever. Chloan, would you defend me, please? Cut him some slack. This is just what he's like in the morning. Falls over sideways. <laughs> Hey, Ben. Hey, Ben, you set this all up? Yeah. This is pretty rad, man. Oh, man, I want to dig in those so into those eggs. Seems like it wasn't such a big mistake to bring you after all. <laughs> mistake? I'm just kidding, eh? Hey, kid, lighten up a little. Lighten up? <laughs> oh, jeez. I'm sorry, dude. 
I have a bad habit of just saying stuff without thinking. Let me... Uh, give me just a moment. Okay. Okay, Ben. It is so cool what you've done here. Starting the fire, making coffee and breakfast. I'm so glad you're here with us. And don't ever change. Thank you. How did I do? You may have some eggs. <laughs> nice. Hey, Chloan. Gross, dude. Brush your teeth first. I haven't brushed mine either. You two need a dang timeout. You're killing us, kids, here. This is Kid Kryptonite. I am literally dead. I would like to take a walk, actually. I'll give you kids some space from... us. Gross. Grown-ups. Hey, Ben. Funny running into you here. In hell. <laughs> oh, what do we get now? Or they're actually taking a hike. It's adorable. Why are you slouching already? Phew! It's good to have some us time. Yeah. Yeah, the kids are fun though, aren't they? It's been an adventure. Oh, yeah. But I kind of can't wait to go camping alone again. Maybe we can go back out to the desert. Oh, or remember the horse at campsite I was reading about? Where they have guided horse tours? And horse dancing lessons? It sounds like an adventure. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. I can't believe how smart they are. Horses? I was not that smart when I was 13. Hey, you switched places. Oh, you're slouching because you're walking uphill. I see. It's a bit weird, though. I um, heard you talking to Mort last night. Oh, yeah, I forgot to tell you. That was so stressful. I thought you handled it perfectly. I was just trying not to mess up. It's so easy to mess up a kid. They just absorb everything around them. Ugh, I'm not built for this. You have better instincts than you think. Ha! <laughs> no way. No way. Uh, yes you do, Chloe. Oh wow, this is okay. We're on top of a very high ledge right now. Why? Where are you going? Do you remember at our wedding? Your mom cornered us? And she kept saying, Where's my grandbaby? She was drunk. And we told her that we had already discussed many times. That was a long time ago. And she cried and cried until you caved. You said, maybe. You sided against me at our wedding. I wasn't siding against you. Later, you told me that you were just trying to appease her. That, of course, we had already agreed. We agreed, right? Oh, where is this heading to? Oh, boy. I mean, um, he has some tickles. He's like, why? I, I'm ready for kids. And Chloanne is like, nah, never in my whole life I'm going to get kids. Which makes sense because it's a very uh, difficult decision. I just want to talk about it. That's all I'm saying. Just talk a little. I feel a little differently. Well, I don't. I don't want kids. I don't like kids. I hate it. Hate it being a kid. It took so long to be happy. To figure out what I want. And what I don't want. But I did it. I like the life we have. It's all I've ever wanted. 
I love you. But that's it. It's all I can do. And if you love me, then you love a childless crow. That's who I am. And I thought you knew that. Yeah, that's a thing. Hey, Glowin. You've been really good with them. You're a good uncle. You're a good aunt. But I can't have this discussion. This is not a discussion. If we could just... We've already had this discussion. Look. There's a... There's a woodpecker. Oh. Yeah. Yep. That's the thing. I'm sorry for... I, I don't want to ruin this trip. I've had a good time. With you. Ben and Mort are good kids. I'm sure Joni will let us take them out again. Every once in a while. Yeah, I'd like to do that. Great. Me too. Great. Yeah. The thing is that... Um, quote unquote babysitting your cousins is a lot different than having your own kids. How do you know? Because I know. <laughs> I know. I got plenty of cousins. And uh, I also got a kiddo. And they're two completely different worlds. Not comparable. So if you think, hey, I'm very good with my cousins. Doesn't mean you can't be very good with your kids. I mean, now that's not what I want to say. I mean, you can probably be very good with your kids. But it's it's very different. It's, it's more stressful to have your own little demon running around. <laughs> Hey, Ben, honey, do me a favor and meet me over by the picnic table. All right. See you there. Wait, what? Hey, oh, whoa, 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 what's going on? What's the matter, Ben? Oh, I like being with you. Like, as a couple? I mean, like, right now, just us. Our own little world. I'm going to kiss you, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. What are you thinking about? That was cool. Oh, they actually... Ooh, butterflies. Oh, look at them. That's so adorable. That is so adorable. And they're actually good kids. They really are. Wait, is this the end? I hope not. I don't think so. Now well, let's do this chapter. Where are we heading to now? Because this is... You guys are pretty romantic. Two of you. Like your buddies. That's what she said. They were buddies and then suddenly they kind of fell in love. Or kind of crushed on each other? Love is going to grow right now because, yeah, the things that are happening, they're fit for each other. It's so nice. Why are we walking in a stream? Why are my socks wet? This is not good. You got to get, how do you call it again? Jungle foot? I, I don't know. What are we doing here? Is the stick something that we should be interacting with? Oh, yeah, the perfect stick. And I thought today couldn't get any better. This is exactly what I've been looking for. Honestly, everything is just so perfect right now. I feel like I might cry. It's a beautiful stick. I knew you'd get it. We're in the tent. We're in the tent, but we're going to continue next time. So thank you very much for watching White Ocean, Big Jacket, and I will see you next time.